I'm really curious how this is going to go. Ooh. Oh, there's a ton around here. I do kind of desperately need herbs. I'm planning on collecting more herbs tonight. Oh, they did manage to get it up here. Oh, did they actually kill it? Oh, it is dead. So I don't have to kill it, I just have to dissect it. Right. He is ready, Yargachin. He only waits for you, Yargachin. Much joy in such waiting. Soon he will become himself, and the sky and earth will return to their due places. Gorhon shall flow, and harsh winter will chase away the foul autumn. That which came from the ground shall return to the ground. A blade for you, Yargachin, to trace his lines properly. Is this uh, Menhu's finger? Uh, that's a good blade. It is. It's a little bit hurt, but that's fine. Oh, right, I don't need to equip it. Um, yeah, I will definitely use this over the lancet. Trace the lines. Take your due. They're ready to take the blood and everything. Hold on. Hold on just a second. Just, just a second. Just, I'm trying to see if those lines match the map. I think they do? It's hard to tell. Would be appropriate though, wouldn't it? No blood. But there's meat. Is that it? The Boha grants you his blood. Take the blood. The Boha are immune to earth plague. The disease rolls off them. Water off foul. The blood is strong. Drink it, Jargachin. It's good for your health. Bayarla, people. I'll take as much as I need myself. Actually, wait. Uh... I want to get as much of this blood as possible. Should I just say they don't ever get sick, you're sure? We keep eyes on every bull. We love them. Know them better than our children. If a bull died, how could we have missed it? A learned man came to us. He said the bulls brought the disease. He was a fool. He made a mistake. So there's something special about their blood. Sure, why not? Bull blood. Useless for crafting. Show this to Dankovsky? Useless for crafting? Are you saying I can't brew with it? Bulls don't get sand pest. Why? Although to be honest, I care much less about the why than about the how. How can I use it, if at all? A puzzle that can only be solved with a microscope. I see buckets of blood, though. Can I not take those at all? I can't. Okay. I just hope it's not the case that each one of these can turn into one panacea. Because in that case, I only have one panacea. <laughs> Nothing else to do? I want to be super certain of that. Can I speak with you? Is that Nara? I th yeah, I think it's Nara. Hmm, I just moved away from the bull a little bit, and 
couple things updated here. The pan- oh, Actually, I should read this one first. It feels like the cure for this pest can only be made from a minotaur. A chimera. Half human, half bull. Where would I find such a creature? Indeed. Where would I? I don't think I saw anything like that in my last playthrough, did I? Those creatures with super long necks and hooves. I mean, they have hooves, but they didn't look anything like bulls. And then this also happened. The panacea requires a non-existent component. I need to pour a paradox into the Olympic. But I refuse to give in. Sooner or later I'll find the answer. Or it will find me. The map didn't update, so I'm still going to head over to Dankovsky's place. I hope I don't have to wait too long for Dankovsky to investigate the blood. Your behavior is ridiculous. Stop playing detective and start tending to the sick. No vaccine yet. Another fruitless attempt. But there must be a solution to this problem. There must. I guess? I can't mention the blood right away. Anyway, how's it going? Any progress? I got something. Bulls can't get infected. Are you sure? I had the same line of thinking. At least that's the first thing I checked. And? The whole bull thing. I had one delivered to me. I injected it with a strain, intending to collect a blood sample the next day. But the beast disappeared in the night. Any idea who could be behind it? Disappeared in the night? Sounds like what Nohair does to me. Strange. Here, take a look. A sample of bull blood. Are you a mind reader? No, it's just that you have experience with this. You're a scientist. I'm a surgeon. Leave it with me. I'll study it. It will only take a few hours. In that time, I suggest you hit the cot somewhere. I've seen corpses prettier than you. I can't have a lot on my plate. I'll just drop by later. While Dankowski is working, I could take a nap or do other things. I'll check on his progress in a couple of hours. I hope I only need to come back here and not to like Ava Jan's place, which is where the Dankowski is staying, I think. Because I'm going to go collect herbs and brew. Collected a bunch of herbs and came back to my place. It turns out I can talk to Sticky again. Why the long face? What happened? Well, I think I figured something out about the cure. Will you tell me? I know what kind of organic sample we need, but I've got no idea where to find it. Come on, keep talking. Do I need to pry every single word out of you? So, bulls have antibodies, right? Cells that destroy the disease. And people can carry the microbe itself in their blood, but they can't weaken it. Do you understand? I can't get the two together, but I need to. So what? Can't you mix them? I need some sort of minotaur, but they don't exist. So what's your plan now? I just got an idea. I'll look for a creature that combines the traits of both man and bull. The traits of both man and bull. A minotaur. Foreman Oyun. Right? They look rather bullish. They even wear that... All that stuff that makes him look like a bull. Foreman Oyun. Of course, at this point, we haven't met them. Uh, I wonder 
when I can meet them. Mm. Little Vlad is the one who knows Foreman Oyun. I suppose maybe Big Vlad as well, but Young Vlad is the one who told me about them. Just out of curiosity, what if I drink some Twyrine? Would it highlight Baby Vlad's place? No, just another cash. Alright, let's do some brewing and some eating. I almost have max hunger. I guess the fresh meat? Let's do the fresh meat. It's quite large. And one should do almost my entire bar. Nice. I'll stick the other one here. I've got three fresh meats, seven smoked meat, four Koshiks, and then I got a couple pemmicans on me. Beautiful. Oh man, my thirst is high. Nah, I won't drink again. I'll drink later. Anyway, herb picking. I managed to get 14 swevery. I didn't think I got that many, but holy hell. Uh, yeah, kind of just enough everything, really. And that's just what I got. I still have some packed away in here. Basic herbs. No special ones. And I got a couple ash and swish. Let's get brewing. Gonna need some more clean water. So I'm gonna make... Let's make a full stack of the ash and swish. Okay, I have a lot of black now. Let's make these two ashen swishes, and I can mix it with anything, so let's mix it with black. Give me a couple of zeros. Let's take some brown and... Brown and shit. What is it? For, to make basic zeros. Brown and what? Brown and blood. Yeah. Wait, I'm making Yas tinctures? Whoops, that's fine, I needed to make them anyway. Man, I have so much water. It's so important that I stockpiled all that water. Brown and blood. Eight of those should be enough. Now I need more zeros. So that wasn't brown and blood? Oh no, it's brown and black. I don't... Yeah, I don't know why I read it like that. Brown and black. Okay. Yeah, that should be good. Let's sharpen Menhu's finger. Oh, do I still only have one thimble? I do. With Menhu's finger, I'm thinking... Do I even want the Lancet? I don't know. I'll keep them both on me. I certainly have the space, don't I? I think the quest just updated. I think Dinkovsky must be done with the bull blood. Yes. Oh, they went back to their place. That makes sense, because that's where their equipment is. Well, uh, I'm going to catch the boat. Almost at Tegankovsky's place, and uh, odd sounds are coming from this house. Yeah, you hear that? Sounds like people hammering things. What in the hell is going on in here? Is this related to the bodies? I already marked one place, though. Is there another place to mark? How can I help you, Doctor? What are those sounds? What sounds? Upstairs, second floor. It's a cat. Step aside, now. 
This is neighborly business, Doctor. We don't need you here. Get the hint already. Fine. I'll send orderlies here, then. Would you rather deal with them? Shit. Oh, I didn't realize they would just start punching me. Holy shit. Okay. Well. Bandage. And... Let's get my stamina back. Um, I have this lockpick that has basically no health, which means it should kill somebody in one hit. Need my stamina back, though. Do I have time to do this? I guess. I, I want to make sure I get to Dankovsky before midnight. I should have time. Actually, do I want to kill them? Maybe I shouldn't kill them. Maybe I should just punch them into submission. I can't deal with two at the same time, though. Sorry, buddy. Yeah, that, that hurt my reputation. Badly did that hurt my reputation? I mean, I was well respected and now no one cares about me, which hurts, but that sucks. Feels bad, considering I just killed one person. Then again, one person's, you know, lives are worth a lot. Lives are meaningful. I shouldn't, f like, just flippantly think, like, I killed one person. That shouldn't make people really care. No, I see why it matters. But I don't think I could have really defeated two at the same time blocking all their attacks I'm gonna stick with that the fuck commoner did you come to mark this house You were, yeah, you were locked in the room. That's So that's the sound of them banging to get out. Did they lock you up? Don't you know? New order. Quarantine. Forbidden for people to go outside. Yet here we are. Our neighbors want to hide this from the authorities. They're afraid of the quarantine. Terrified, even. You can go outside. No one will stop you. When the cough started, they began avoiding me. And then they locked me here alone. Yes, I'm sick, but not with this terrible plague. It's just a cold. Flu, maybe. Go ahead and examine me. Just no quarantine, please. And don't mark this house. I can tell it's not the plague. Your skin is normal. I found a house with a suspicious person inside. Is this the right one? I don't think there are corpses here, though. Wait. Oh. Oh no. I think I maybe broke the quest when I marked the door before going inside and seeing the bodies. Unless I can remark it, I don't think it actually considers me to have marked a door. So the infection is going to spread if I don't... I guess spread to this region if I don't stop this before midnight, which is very, very soon. Let me see if I can remark the door. It's this one down here. Do I have, uh, I have more chalk. It's already marked, though. Uh, yeah, that's the right way. I got time. I got time. It is marked, though. Yeah, fuck. I, don't I broke the quest, I guess. I'm not going to reload all the way back to when I did that. 
It's going to spread the infection to this area, which means I'm going to have to give immunization stuff to Ava Yon and all three Sabarovs or kinds rather. Oh man, that's a lot more people to give immunization immunizations to, but I'll live. Cat's screaming behind me. She's playing. She gets loud when she plays. What kind of disease is this? What kind of disease is this? Well, seems like you were right. But it's of no use to either of us. Why's that? Indeed, they produce antibodies. A lot of them. But they're useless to us. Tell me more. How well are you versed in raw sample hyperimmunization for xenogeneic serums? Do you know how immunoglobulins are extracted from a native serum? No. Sandpest evolves and mutates in human blood fast. It doesn't do that in bulls. It's as though bulls are of no interest to it but their antibodies could theoretically be useful. Of no interest, you say? Wait a second. What? No, nothing, just thinking. Unless the disease is weakened, we can't inject a person with those antibodies. It's too risky. Children, for example, definitely wouldn't survive the procedure. We're too different from bulls. Meaning, what we need is... A minotaur. A creature that combines man and bull. Form an Oyun. Dankovsky's findings support my own suspicion. Common bulls are useless to us. I'm glad we agree. It doesn't help, though. So there's another connection here. That's probably Foreman Oyun, if I had to guess. But I don't think Act 3 ends tomorrow. I certainly hope it doesn't. I guess we're about to see? Maybe? At midnight? Let's see how lucky death is. The hunt for your friend continues. Come dawn, you won't be able to help him anymore. Apart from that, the night will be uneventful. You managed to protect the bridge square from an infection. You managed to grasp a crucial hint, so I didn't read the rest of that. Okay. Good baby, Vlad. Good baby. Good, Laura. I hear a baby screaming. Khan? Or Han, rather? Fuck. Okay. Just one infected. I have two... two things. Of, uh... Time schmatter. flies faster and faster with the So yeah, I hear a screaming baby, which means it's nearby, and one of these places must be an infected district. I should go get that baby. Oh, damn, my exhaustion is almost about to start hurting me. Um... I can sleep at Denkovsky's place. I don't want to risk running out of time to do everything I want to do for tonight, so... I'm going to take a painkiller and just sleep for one hour. Made from blood, so that's not very good. Made from liver tissue... That's probably the same tier as blood. Oh, what's this one? Kidney tissue. I just had to dream. I don't think I had this dream before, did I? 
Oh god, not these fucking screams again. You have ears like a jerboa. Did you know you can catch shingles from a jerboa? Just like that. Well, you have ears like a mouse. Mu Umen. I hate it here. They tell me all day long that I'm the most important person, yet they won't let me out, won't let me play, won't bring me anything I ask for. And they keep screaming and screaming through the walls. Who would want to live in such a place? What would you like to be brought, girl? Strawberry. It's a nice white berry. I saw it when I was in the tower. It smells so yummy. And raspberry. It can also be red or white, but in truth it's yellow. Demar Goe Be. So pretty, so tasty. That's what the colors of berries are in the polyhedron? Never eaten those. I've only seen them in books. She Yunde Arebshe? Why did you come anyway? You must have some sort of request for our not so highness. I'm listening. Do you know who or what an Udurg is? I know the word. It's from a tale. Or a riddle, maybe. What tale? The Udurg has a special mound, his ear sticking from the ground. Just make a wish and grab the mud until your hands are filled with blood. It's about the old village. So I guess the Udurg is there. Ah. Okay, so this is what maybe leads us to the blood there. A special mound, his ear sticking from the ground. Is that what that is, an ear? Make a wish, grab the mud until your hands are filled with blood. It's about the old village. Okay, okay, okay. How do I get there? Follow the road by which bulls come to us from the steppe. Medanekshe. Now that was a great place to live. I'd like it so much to leave these ugly walls and move there. Life would become incredible, and it's so easy. Thanks, kid. Don't go there now. Today he's not listening. Go tomorrow, after you wake. Find the ear, whisper in it, and it'll grant you a wish. And please let him know I hate it here and can't wait to leave. I've had enough of this place. Timelda. Go tomorrow after you wake. So, 7.30. Basically the official start of day six. Good, because otherwise I was going to run there straight in the night, to be honest. A wish. Well, I only have one. And do come back here sometime. Bay Haranob, you're a smart girl. Stay here for now. Wait some more. Wait, I can talk with you? Not to go on all fours. That is the law. Are we not men? Who are you? Our mother superior, joy of our people, long expected you. Speak now to me. Oh, I mean, I already spoke to her. Uh, I am? It's all the same. Mother Superior has hundreds of eyes, ears, and hands. We are all one. This tongue is her tongue. These ears are her ears. I have long waited for you, guest. Speak. I will listen. I'd rather look around. Mother Superior, joy of our people, wants you to lead us away into the steppe. We want to go home. Have you not heard her? She likes not this place. This evil cesspit overflows with ennui and misery. 
I want to inspect the termitary. Impossible. It is dangerous out there. Why? This is not to be spoken of, or there will be punishment. Such is the law. I hear screams. That means some people are alive out there. Comforting. Yeah, comforting. I, Mother Superior, joy of our people, now grant you an audience. Have you seen already how the Udurg suffers without our care? Have you leaned against his ear? Have you tasted his humors? Or have you quenched his thirst? Where is he? Everywhere. In here, too? You'll see for yourself if you go to the old village and look closely. Very closely. I've been there back when I was a kid. It's empty. Thankfully, the dream ends before I get out there. Jesus. All right, I, I barely slept. That'll be enough for the night. Ooh, something updated. So thirsty. Damn. Also pretty hungry. The Udurg's ear is in an abandoned steppe village, whatever that means. It's quiet for now. I need to wait. Man, this is going in such an interesting direction now that I'm doing all these things I never did before. Okay, well, for now, I think this is a pretty good place to end the episode. So I hope you've enjoyed so far, and when I return, we are gonna... Well, I think there's a baby to save nearby, we should visit the theater, go to the dead item shop, help out Reuben. Yeah, plenty to do. <laughs>